morning. Good morning, you guys. It is 12.08. It's Thursday, June 6th. I am waiting on my fans to come pick me up because he might be going to the town over. Anyway, to go pick up something for my uncle, um, because it can't fit in his car. Sorry, he's like blowing up my phone because I told him I asked my fiance, but anyway, um, we're going to do that, and then I don't know what we're doing afterwards. We're supposed to go taste testing some food for the, um, wedding. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm just wearing this gray, it's supposed to be like an off the shoulder thing, but it just says hashtag weekend on it in gold. And I'm just wearing these shorts from Walmart. Or both from Walmart. But anyway, um, I'm cold, so I actually have my fan off. <sighs> Excuse me. But anyway, I just wanted to update you guys on how things are going. Um,. So we did find a vendor or whatever you call them for the food for the wedding. We just got taste tested, as I was just saying. And oh. We're in the process of getting pre-approved for a loan for a house, so we're in the process of that. Um, I think that's really about it. I have more vlog footage than I do main channel videos because I am running out of ideas. Um, I've asked on Instagram for people's opinions. I've asked on my actual YouTube channel what they want to see, who you guys want to see, whatever. No one's giving me ideas, so I'm at a hold right now because I don't know what to do. I'm just doing what I have pre-filmed already. And so, yeah. Sorry, I'm playing with the <laughs> lens cap. But, um, I guess we're not going there now, so. <laughs> no. I'm still tired. I got up at like 11 something. <sighs> so, anyway, I just wanted to update you guys on that. So, I will just talk to you guys later. And something interesting is happening. Hey guys, it is 7.58. We are at the car wash so he can do his job. Um, yeah. We have breaded pork chops for dinner. Um, what else? I'm trying to think of what we did today since I've last talked to you. Um, we went to the bank. And then we... I'm trying to think. We dropped his mom off at the store. Um, we talked to someone about catering for the wedding. And, um... I've been talking to the bank on and off all day of a loan, and I, I'm just going to put this out there. Just because pe some people don't make the same as you do, you know, um, some of us aren't able, sorry my hair is like bothering me, some of us aren't able to have these fancy nice things, um, some of us actually work hard for our money. So to sit there and pretty much 
slap somebody in the face for or being judgmental as the word I've been using all day because they don't make that much or you don't think they can handle the payments or you think they can't do this or you think just just don't be that person okay it's annoying and it feels very downgrading um so I just want to put put that out there don't be like that wow lighting is definitely better on this side um Okay. Anyway, I'm gonna just sit you guys there for a second so I can fix my hair. But anyway, so needless to say, we may not even go with this bank anymore because of how rude they are being. And sad thing is, my parents have an account through them and I had an account with them at one point, but I withdrew all my money from that account a while back to move with a different bank because of this problem. But I still ended up going back for a different account. And now I'm definitely probably going to be withdrawing that account and starting my uh, starting that account at my other bank where I actually my main bank account is, if that makes any sense. <sighs> So yeah, so moral of the story is we are going to try to find someone else to get a loan through. Um, I don't know where that red splotch just randomly came from, but anyway, so we're dealing with that problem. Um, what else? Oh, I haven't got it. I'm sure you guys this. Okay. So, I've been wanting this one case from the Brain's casemate. I think. Yeah, it's like $50 for this case, okay? And we were rolling through Walmart. Hold on one second, guys. Sorry about that. But anyway, we were rolling, strolling, strolling through Walmart because they're doing like, they're revamping the store and stuff. And I got a glimpse of this phone case. I'm like, oh my gosh. This is like the exact same case I'm winning from Casemate. But Casemate has it for $50. So I'm hoping this is cheaper. If it is, I'll just get it. Because it's close enough. So I walk back over and I'm like, this is definitely the case I've been wanting. And it was only $12. Compared to, you know, the $57. So, this is the bad boy. It's so pretty. It's like this foil, like foil, I think is what it said. And then the sides are just clear. And then like the volume button and the lock button are rose gold. It's just so pretty. I don't remember the brand though. It really didn't say a brand on it. All I know it was in a pink package and it says it said something about spoiling yourself. I think I still have the picture. Mm. I guess not. Mm, yeah, you you deserve something pretty. Is what the bottom of the box said. So I took a picture of it. Um, oh, I guess that's the brand right there, fellows. Whatever. There's our website. I figured you were interested. But anyway. So, yeah, other than that, there's really nothing going on. Um, so, yeah. After we leave here from the car wash, I have my little. My filing box back there because I need to go throw some papers and get rid of some. Um, that's a thing. And we gotta go back to Walmart to finish getting. No, we already had stuff for Saturday, so we gotta go back to Walmart to get deodorant and personal hygiene products. Okay, that's basically what we're gonna go get 
because I need some more shampoo and is that all I need? We gotta get cheese and deodorant for my fiance. I think that's about it. So, with that being said, I will just talk to you guys in a bit. Okay, so, I didn't get to finish vlogging last night because, dum-dum, he forgot my, um, vlog camera in my car. Great. So, if you guys remember, sorry, me showing you this really pretty case from Mom Robert that I just loved so much. I just had to go back to Walmart last night to go get to go look at the other ones I had. So I got this one's the same as this one, but just like this silver color, and you can see like the, it's like a rainbow. Super pretty, love it. So I bought this case today, and I also got this one, which is clear. And then it's like gold with white daisies on it. I'm gonna use this one today. I'm gonna swap my hair in a second because I just got home. But yeah, it's super pretty. And this is what the box looks like. Um, the squeaking noise is my bed. But anyway, this is what the boxes look like. They're just white, gold, and pink, which obviously that's what attracted me to it. And um, it just says six feet, six feet drop tested, made for, and then the iPhone type. Then you deserve something pretty. And then the back says protective and pretty, so I don't know if that's the brand. Um, shock ridge reduces impact on drops, metallic button accents, and slick profile. So I don't know if Protective and Pretty is the brand, or if this is the brand out of here. So, so this case has like, this one has like the silver buttons on the sides, like a mirrored. And then, so does this daisy one. No, but this one has gold. So gold. Like a rose gold and a silver. Um, they had two other cases which I wasn't. They're cute, but I wouldn't use them. Um, if I go back to Walmart, I'll take a picture of them. I, the other brand, I think the On brand, I used to get all the time. Um, they have one, and it's like the waterfall ones. And it said, love you latte. And it looked like you were spilling coffee. And... What the heck is that? Anyway. They had coffee beans in it. And it was super cute. I did film today, guys. Look. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that. But today, I just... We went up to the city to his aunt's house and went to Illinois to his sister's house. And we just picked up things for his mom there. Um, yeah, we didn't get it until like 1.30 or so. We didn't leave town until like 4 o'clock. And then we didn't get back in the town until like almost 11 from his sister's. Then we ate dinner. Um, made cake and stuff for tomorrow for his nephew's party and then went to the car wash so he can do his thing came back showered washed Riverdale and here we are now and it is oh hello 3 or 3 in the morning so yeah I'm just gonna sit here watch YouTube um Shout out to 
There's a gal right here. Lita Elise, I think that's how you pronounce her name. I don't know, but shout out to you. So, anyway, um, yeah, I'm gonna end this clip here. So I will just talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye, guys.